Criminal violence is a major problem in isolated parts of Mexico. Western Michoacan state is the latest hotspot, with criminal organizations recently attacking electric power stations and terrorizing citizens. Usually the violence stays outside the capital. Then came the case of 12 young people who were kidnapped and murdered here. Police officials were arrested in connection with the massacre. As the violence continues, companies specializing in security and protection are finding a steady stream of clients. This one makes special clothing designed for top business people and politicians who need extra protection. Enrique Peña Nieto used this model during his 2012 presidential campaign. An increasing number of Mexican clients are seeking lightweight anti-ballistic protection that's virtually invisible under street clothing. Oscar Loaiza of the Miguel Caballero Armored Clothing Company says his elite clients are still purchasing protective garments valued in the thousands of dollars. These days you see more people with bodyguards, more people with security equipment. And that means these products are getting greater circulation. People are becoming more aware of their security to avoid risks. Leading security analysts at the risk control company say most businesses in Mexico are safe, but there's good reason why some are worried. The principal concerns tend to be related to common and violent crime or road-related crime such as carjacking, but also increasingly high-impact crime such as extortion and kidnapping. A study by the government's own statistics agency found that in 2012, the number of kidnappings in Mexico surpassed 105,000, which helps to explain why demand for better protection here and across the country remains high. Frank Contreras, CCTV, Mexico City.